Hi everybody and welcome to Bush à Bush. My name is Delphine and I will explain you how to make some great recipe. And we will start today cooking the moelleux au chocolat. Yummy! To realize that recipe, you will need four eggs. Uh, the darker you take, the darker your cake will be. To put inside your wee cake the white chocolate, which is a bit nicer and it changes also. Granulated sugar, salt, butter, it's sweet clam because I will explain to you what we can do with that. Here in the accessories, you will take six ramekin. The absolutely essential electric whisk, two melting pot, and uh, a spoon, obviously. We need 200 grams of dark chocolate. Okay, 200 grams. You have to save some pieces of chocolate because you will need it to put in the cake in the end of the recipe. You take a boil, you brought your chocolate in there, it's very hard work, but hard is done. Well then, salt, butter, 80 grams, oh, too much, you cut it in wee pieces in your chocolate. Forget to shake it sometimes because it could burn. Step one finish. It has to look like that. Okay, if there is some butter still hard, you just wait a few minutes. It will keep melting while you put your eggs apart. Two. You put apart the yolk and the white in two different melting pot and you repeat the operation with the four eggs I start uh, whisking the eggs white until they form peaks let's go if you're not confident you can put just a wee pinch of salt in there it will make it harder way because otherwise you won't have the same cake in your plate. Oh, and I forgot to preheat the oven. You have to preheat the oven at uh, 180 degrees. Sugar, 80 grams. You beat the yolk and the sugar together until it got quite white. Uh, it has to be white because it proves you that the sugar and the, love and the yolk are perfectly together. It has to look like that. Step, uh, I don't know, three. You need your flour. We said two big spoons. That's a big spoon for me. One flour, uh, one spoon of corn flour. You don't have to, if you don't have corn flour, this is not a drama, just take two spoons of plain flour. But if you can take one each, this is the best. You add your chocolate with no pieces of butter in there anymore because as I told you, it was warm, so now it's enough. You add it in your mix. And you should obtain something like that. When you take your white, and you slowly incorporate 
chocolate to the eggs slowly and gently you should obtain this kind of texture here we go okay now the sweet clam just to add a kind of nice taste you peel it not too much and if you're not sure or if you are very happy with the taste of the clam you just take you just take one we piece like that and you just press it you will love it totally and obviously you don't leave it on the top of your cake same things to have those we moelleux au chocolat Okay, I need space. My six ramekin. I take butter and you just spread it a bit everywhere in there. That way. You will fill up all your ramekin halfway. Once you've got that, okay, it's not halfway, but I did not do enough sauce, so I did uh, what I could, okay? <laughs> you take white chocolate or dark chocolate, this is up to you, I will use both. You will put gently a white chocolate piece. So you obtain this kind of thing with the chocolate in the middle. You have to put it gently because you don't want it to go in the bottom of your cake. You just cover all your wee pieces of chocolate until you can't see it anymore. That's a good stuff. Okay, when this is done, you got that thing. You put it in the oven. And you wait for it to cook for 12 minutes. You just have to take it out the oven. Famous with moelle au chocolat. So now we have to unmold it. This is what you obtain in your cake in the end. A nice cake with some mold chocolate in there. It's very nice. Very appreciated by myself. Moelle au chocolat. I wish you a great tasting of that with things. And I see you later for another video. I will teach you how to do a pie with uh, red berries, etc. It will be amazing too. I'll see you later on Bouche à Bouche. Don't forget to like my page, Bouche à Bouche, on Facebook. You can follow me on Twitter, on Instagram, or anywhere. I am. Every